Theodore Roosevelt said, I do not believe there ever was any life more attractive to a vigorous young fellow than life on a cattle ranch in those days. I enjoyed the life to the full. Hi everybody, you're watching a Happy Trails Hiking Park Travel Short. Today, we are exploring Grant Coors Ranch National Historic Site in Montana. Grant Coors Ranch National Historic Site is located in Deer Lodge, Montana. Upon entering the National Historic Site, we stopped by the Visitor Center. At the Visitor Center, we found out that the guided tours of the ranch house were full for the day. We did find out about the self-guided tours and the ranger programs that were happening for the day and decided to take advantage of both of those opportunities. In the mid-1800s, the Oregon Trail generated an active trade in livestock. Having successfully wintered stock in the Deer Lodge Valley in 1857, Johnny Grant returned there in 1859 and built a home. He persuaded others to settle near him and they founded the town now known as Deer Lodge. In 1866, Grant sold his ranch home to Conrad Coors. Coors had been in California and had learned about the cattle empire that sprawled over four states and two Canadian provinces. This range was once grazed by millions of bison. But by the 1870s, bison were nearly extinct. They'd been replaced by, quote, the white man's buffalo, which grazed free on the public open range. Coors cattle were among those. The winters of 1886-1887 were very hard in Montana. For Conrad Coors and his half-brother John, it was a sign that the old ways had to change. By the turn of the century, the open range system of cattle raising was nearly gone. But the Corps' operation thrived. 1909 marked one of the biggest years, with cattle sales exceeding $500,000. But by 1918, all their range cattle were sold and the operation was limited to a few hundred acres at the old home ranch in Deer Lodge. Here's the ranger program we caught while we were there. Okay, so we'll give it a try. Oh. You did that like a Woohoo. It's bouncy. They have some It is all good to go. That spring underneath you there? The only spring on that fire wagon. Okay, well that's a nice place to put it. It is underneath the seat. It is, but you, you can imagine this is not just sitting still all day. It is being pulled across the prairie. Yes, right. You know, 10 to 15 miles, 10 to, or 10 to 12 miles a day. It's going to get very, very bumpy. There's no road. Yeah. So you are going over the path of cows and have trod. Your butt's going to be a bit sore. We had a short but interesting visit to Grand Coors National Historic Site in Montana. We would definitely recommend it as a stop if you are traveling between Yellowstone and Glacier National Park. Until next time, this is Kay from Happy Trails Hiking. Thanks for watching.